Just thought I'd uh, touch on a few of my favourite things in the sale coming up on the 30th and the 3rd, 23. One of my favourite pieces in the sale is a 19th century specimen marble top. But it's quite interesting because each individual tablet of marble is indicated on the, on the underside in pencil. So at some time there's been a key to the marbles and what they are, their regions. Um, it's on a, a much later base and it, it's just sort of crying out for to be put back on a, a, a proper base of some kind. Um, its estimate is uh, two to three hundred pounds. Um, I think it's worth every penny of that. The top is much earlier. Um, 19th century bases, 20th century. It's one of my favorite items. Next uh, is a pair of late 18th century mahogany hall chairs with an armorial crest. Uh, there's a small carved reserve of a, sh reserve of a shield and inside that has been painted um, a coat of, uh, actually it's not a coat of arms, it's a monogram, it's a family monogram. Lovely gutsy pieces of good rich brown mahogany uh, that you don't see nowadays. Nice crisp patina, um, three to five hundred pounds, good proper antiques. Next item would be this a circular Celanese table, uh, interesting for different reasons more towards the sort of furnishing market, circa 1840 in date. The top is inlaid with a pinwheel of specimen timbers from coconut palm or palmette as they call it, iron wood, obviously Salonese satin wood, uh, calamander. So it would have been a riot of color when it was first worked, but obviously these, t these timbers mellow and in their mellow state they are uh, prized. Um, so nice patina from private source again. Um, some quite exciting items actually. Everyone is looking for something a little bit different and I think these items are slightly different.